this video, I discuss the construction of Afghanistan's largest new commercial port in front of Pakistan's Tarkum port. A new transit crossing between Afghanistan and Turkmenistan will be established in Balamurghab district of Badgis province. This new transit route is created for the purpose of bringing more ease in the field of export and import, and also transit goods. It is said that the construction cost of this route has been determined, and efforts are underway to implement this project. This is a new route that connects Afghanistan with Turkmenistan through Balamorg Heb. On top of this path, work is going on to implement the project. He is talking to companies. To sign a contract for the construction of this road and start practical work on it, engineers have closely examined the sections of this crossing in Balamorga. The creation of a new port and transit passage with Turkmenistan is beneficial for the development of the country's trade and economy. The port that will be built in Balamorg Hab will be the best port. Both oil and flour can enter Afghanistan from that port. This is not the only port that is being built with Turkmenistan. Two other ports have already been built with Turkmenistan. One of its ports is located in Akina, Faria province, and the other port is Turgandi port, which is located in Herat province. And with Turkmenistan, these ports are active. In addition, Haritaran port with Uzbekistan, Shirkan port in Kunduz, and Ai Khanum port in Takar, with Tajikistan, Islam Kala port in Herat, and Zaranj Nimraz port with Iran, Spinboldak port, Torkom port, and Golomkhan port in coast with Pakistan as commercial ports of the country are played in line with trade and transit. This transit road port, which is going to be built with Turkmenistan, will be reopened for the purpose of rapid transfer and increase of exports and imports between the two countries. On the other hand, with the creation of this crossing, the process of goods transfers and increasing transit will cause the economic growth of this province. This transit route will be of great importance in increasing the process of trade transfers between the two countries and will continue to bring economic growth to Badgis province and the country. With the establishment of this port, Afghanistan and Turkmenistan will have three transit zones together. Ports that are active in Faryab, Herat, and will be established in Badgis province. Naturally, the creation and activation of a new port with an important Central Asian country is of considerable importance in line with the growth and development of Afghanistan's commercial transactions with neighboring countries in Central Asia. On the other hand, this action of the Afghan government regarding the activation of the new port on the common border with Turkmenistan is taken while our neighboring country, Pakistan, with various excuses, closes the Torkum crossing, which is one of the main crossings for the passage of people and the transfer of goods. It is believed that this crossing between the two countries has been closed many times, and even though it was opened for pedestrians after a few days, but the merchants and drivers of vehicles full of commercial goods still. They also complain that Pakistan does not allow the passage of these processions to both sides of the supposed Duran line, while since the day of its closure, more than $1 million has been caused to the businessmen of both sides. Our compatriots remember that in the country, when our import was most dependent on Pakistan, especially the import of food items such as flour and oil, that country, with its usual habit, did not allow the dishes filled with food items such as flour and oil. Enter the territory of Afghanistan, and in this way, they caused a sharp decrease in food in our country and a sudden increase in its price which with the opening of ports and trade passages with neighboring countries, this monopoly of Pakistan was put an end to, and the people, our needy people, were able to get the food they needed at a reasonable price. With all this in mind, we consider the opening of the new transit passage between Afghanistan and Turkmenistan as a good omen, and we hope that the expansion of trade between the two countries can lead to the reduction of Afghanistan's monopoly on transit routes with some neighboring countries. Become us something that the people of Afghanistan have been suffering from for years, and these exploitative countries have not given up any opportunity to destroy Afghanistan and its political and economic interests.
The construction of the largest new commercial port in Afghanistan and the creation of a new transit passage between Afghanistan and Turkmenistan have many benefits for Afghanistan and its people. As a new and important route for the transfer of goods and reducing dependence on other crossings, this port and transit passage helps to facilitate the export and import of the country. It allows manufacturers and traders to access new markets and increase their income. The establishment of this port and transit passage will cause economic growth in Badgis province and the country of Afghanistan. This project will stimulate job creation and help to increase the production and income level of the people. Until now, Afghanistan was facing problems of trade monopoly due to dependence on other crossings for its exports and imports. The creation of this new port will allow the reduction of this monopoly and help to diversify the trade. This project will strengthen Afghanistan's relations with neighboring countries. The establishment of the transit passage with Turkmenistan will make Afghanistan an important transit area in the Central Asia region and strengthen economic relations with neighboring countries. With the establishment of this new port, Afghanistan will be less dependent on other crossings, especially the Tarkum crossing of Pakistan, and will be more independent in conducting its commercial transactions. The establishment of this port and transit passage can help reduce the economic losses caused by the closure of other crossings in the neighboring regions of Afghanistan and protect merchants and traders from these losses. In general, the establishment of Afghanistan's largest new commercial port and transit passage will lead to economic development, reduce trade monopoly, strengthen regional relations, and increase transit facilities for the country and the people of Afghanistan. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to this channel to be aware of our next videos. Bye until the next video.